Of course, the little capped placing top four here in Tekken. Rectify Boys, one of my close friends from Gainesville, is Rectify Wonderbread. Oh, really? Yeah, that's awesome. They're Smash Ultimate player. Fantastic. He was top 12 last year in DreamHack Austin. I don't know if he's entered Tekken in any of the other events that we've gone to at any of the other DreamHack events. I don't think he entered Tekken at CEO. Do you think we'll get any uh, Tekken in this year tournament, though? Um, I, I honestly don't remember. I don't know. If we do, uh, look at, I hope he makes it that far, because he's going to stomp. <laughs> like, he's going to body everyone with Dragon. So we get Fish Bujin and Business Casual Man. Fish Bujin, the heavy of this game. Oh, yeah, he's, he's a real beefster. I believe that's uh, referred to as Bara in that, adult, in that animation community. Okay. Don't Google that if you're under 18. Looks like they're figuring out what their characters do. That's actually probably the most important part of a button check here. It's not like, oh, I have jump on A. When I press A, do I jump? It's like figuring out what your character does. If yeah. you're basically anybody but Isam or Foda. Really, though. I mean, and that's it's kind of curious that they're giving them this long of a button check, too. Because I feel like you should be like, here's 10 seconds, go. Yep. Now, it'd be nice if this had the button check in the character select, like Rivals does. That is that super is like, sick. That's amazing that that exists. If that was like the whole game and it just ended there and like that was the tech that they introduced for Rivals, like that would still be so sick. You could just play it all from the CSS screen. I'm, I'm mad, <laughs> mad jealous of that. That is so cool. Rest in peace to former, uh, to former memory formats. That background popped up for a second. Shout out to Dan Fornace for that one. So he did not, unfortunately. Oh no. So winner's side is gonna be Elegant and Mars, Tweak and Buzz. Oh no. Samsora, MVD, and Cosmos, and Joker. Man, that's the have a, We have a Samus in top eight tomorrow. That's pretty sick. Uh, Samus is low tier in that's ultimate. That's pretty sick. That's dope. All right, so we have a giant stage now. For, an, it seems like maybe another button check. So this one does have, I think it has something floating on the top that hits you maybe. But it's also a little bit weird with that, with the steps and how you play around the steps. Okay, so I'm gonna keep it a thousand. It looks like neither of these players have ever touched that. Oh yeah, absolutely. But Sandstorm will have more experience in traditional platform fighters, like Rivals, like Smash. Oh, just pausing, pausing mid game. Cool. Uh, I don't know what that was. I don't know if that was just an, oh, okay. Chicken, chicken. Hearing some people rooting for Sandstorm in the background. That is a very casual business casual, man. Yeah, that gets you a call from HR. Yeah, like all of them are shirtless, which is, that, that's normal on Casual Friday, right? But oh. the fact that he's wearing jeans, oh no. I mean, we are on a casting couch right now. I feel a little uncomfortable by this. Oh, you shouldn't. Don't worry. I'm here to guide you through all of this, <laughs> except for most of it, which I don't know anything about. <laughs> And then once we get to Rivals, you're, you're going to guide me. I'm just excited that we get Rivals, too, because yep. I feel like they're going to see some really interesting gameplay in that. If we, if we do get some people that are familiar with it. If not, it's someone's going to die very early, very quickly, multiple times. Because it's very easy to die in Rivals if you don't know how to recover. Now, that looked like a special attack. It looked, like a, it looked like a heavy attack, but it didn't really send Business Casual Man very far. But maybe it's just because he's low damage at this point. Ooh, Ooh nice edge guard. Charging up another one. Ended up touching the wall, so we got the uh, invulnerability frames. Leaving them glutes. Dance from still able to get back. Dunked. Dunk, drop the QR code, scan that for this beating. Yo, Capt is nuts at Slap City, man. He's crazy. He's so good. He hasn't died yet. Look at all this money he's building up, too. Getting that flex on, that disposable income. I bet he doesn't know how to use it. Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> he might get lucky. It's probably the special button, but I don't think he knows how to use it. <laughs> just, <laughs> Cap is just going to die. Dumpster. I didn't even think he recovered. And that's why you always re-rack your weights, ladies and gentlemen. If not. Now, now something that Sandstorm does have is he can grab and then he can suicide with the grab. 
over the edge. If he, get, if he picks it up right on the edge. The only problem is he's behind right now. By a lot. And I don't know if he dies first or if the person he grabs dies first. But I think the person he grabs dies first. Oh, he's just holding it. That aerial charge. Money, money, money. Looks like Little Captain's just completely overspacing so many things. Sandstorm is finding some damage. Nice little air dodge. Give him some invulnerability frames to get back down. Ooh, he was charging that one. Cap beat him with the frames. Elbow drop. Ooh, pectorals. Got him off the top. There's the recover. Now, you should probably hurt yourself when you smack your head into the ground yeah, like he was like, doing. Like you saw like ESAM do like 10 times in a row. That should be a self. Should be a self. Uh, Some Pichu. Self damage one. Yeah, exactly. Sandstorm seems like he's figuring this out a little bit, though. Is it going to be too little too late? At least he'll have another game, even if he loses this one. He'll have another game because it's best of three. That was so close. Looks like he almost went in the free fall animation and just barely grabbed a ledge. Ooh, Lil' Cap is just going to eat that recovery. Now, because Street Fighter V is a game later on, you saw on the ending screen, on the back of Business Casual Man, he had the, uh, I think it was, it's the same symbol, or it's some, a you mean, symbol you, like you're talking Akuma. About, you're about to say the evil, the evil kanji? Sure. That's what the Akuma one is. Okay. It's, it's the kanji It looks evil. like the Akuma one. Yeah, that's actually a super dope nod and a really cool reference. And I mean, it just like, there's so many cool like tie-ins and everything else, like whether it's intended or not. Uh, so seeing that, like Yoshi has the pose in Smash Ultimate and Smash 4, similar to Ryu. Uh, that's super deep, super neat. Now this is a swap to It'll Do. She's, she's gonna adorable. be able to... She's adorable, not gonna lie. Cap is gonna be able to have kind of, it seems a little bit like Link here. Cause you're seeing the bomb coming out. We saw a spell as well. That's a big slap. It, it, it you is. get a huge uh, spike with that one. Yeah, but what if you get elbow jump? What if you get hit in the face by a dumbbell? That is a small child. That will yeah, be that's... a concussion and a half, possibly a fractured skull. And probably some jail time. Uh, yeah. At least a little bit, depending on who you are. And it depends on the state, though. I don't know what Texas laws are on child abuse. If you're R. Kelly, you might get away with it for a while. Who knows? <laughs> oh, the juggle coming in? I'm gonna, Ooh, go, I'm gonna go ahead and way. say that was your one that's R. Kelly one? joke for that's the day. That's my one. I don't. I don't think we got any more of those. You're assuming that's my first R. Kelly joke of the day. I hope <laughs> it is. <laughs> oh my God! Nearly slid out in front of that charge attack too. Sandstorm's definitely figuring more out. He's a big body against a projectile character though, so just like on its head, that does make things a little difficult. Yeah, if these two players were competent in this game, this would probably be a very tough matchup for the Fish Bungeon player. Uh, I mean, who knows? I mean, Fish Bungeon might have, like, some kind of armor against projectiles that we don't know about. <laughs> God, Wonderfully almighty. placed bomb. Wonderfully placed. I love these animations, though. <laughs> you might see him using that little charge move. Maybe a little bit more. Throwing the dumbbell. Oh, 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 that was brutal. Whoosh. Oh, and the flex. Ooh, this is X. the first the lead. Fair. Watch out. Oh, that's the first lead that Sandstorm had. He's free. Oh, he's flexing. He's flexing. Crowd. He's figuring the game out so fast. Crowd screaming that little cap is free. Unlike R. Kelly, who is in jail. That's true. Also ASAP Rocky, but free ASAP. Yeah, yeah, don't you, free R. Kelly. You leave, leave, him, don't. leave him there. Elbow drop, elbow drop, elbow oh. drop. The tech reads. Oh, Broke. slapped right in the face. I want to see a shield break. That's heavy, too. That's not even just like a 5 or a 15. Like That's a beefy one. That's probably at least 35 pounds. Yeah, that looks like that solid, like, I'm in here for these gains, bro, kind of weight. That's probably 50. Uh oh. <gasps> there it is. Charge it, charge oh. it, charge it. Do you oh. know how to oh. charge it? Oh. Let's find out. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, he's got armor on that. You saw that, right? Yep. Get him out. Get him out. 
What a beautiful end screen too. Just the just that legend like the, just the uh, the Led Zeppelin cover. Yep. Sandstorm having a good time. Ooh, got that throw interrupted by the bomb. There's just little cap falling to his death. Yo, let's replay that SD. <laughs> All right, into it. Back to business casual, man. Ooh, charging Ooh. that one. Ooh. What is that? Is that the stage at night? Gets this music? I mean, that's just the elevator music for business casual man as he attends. It might be. As he ascends into his penthouse suite. I mean, I don't know if you noticed, business casual man is undefeated so far in Mystery Game. That's Internet. true. He is, he is very high tier in Mystery Game. Which could be important. Yeah, big hit by. Uh oh. Okay. Nah, not even worried. I mean, Fishbujin just saw a really tasty worm. That's all he was going for there. Oh my god. Ooh. Nice shield through that. I wonder how long shields take to recharge in this game, too. Not, uh, a, it's a not long, full yet. A long time from yeah. the looks of it. <laughs> Stabbed in the back, which allows me to make a really dated reference. Business Casual Man focused on money, 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 money. Uh huh. That is a famous song by the OJs. Their other famous song is Backstabber. Okay. Unlike the OJ, who is a front stabber. Yeah, he's very, very much, very much One Direction. Production crew loving that 1980s dated joke. Believe it or not, that is not the only OJ joke I've been a part of this weekend. Really? That's not. Man, it's back on Twitter. That was a that was a very strange video he put out. All of them are very strange. You're not wrong. So he dropped three hundo on that hit right there. Will it be worth it? Will he get a good ROI, return on investment? These are young children. You have to explain that's, the terminology. That's, that's why I went on there. See if it'll it'll pay off in the long run. Yeah, you gotta wonder. Ooh, he's charging that one up. At this point, Sandstorm down two stocks. Does he have a good 401k? Will his stock options fully vest? before he wins this game. See, that's the risk, too. I mean, this is a well-oiled machine, an athlete in fish region. Does he have good money management skills? Because it seems that's, like that's Sandstorm, tough. it looks, seems like Little Cap does. Yeah. You know, is he going to be you know, better off in his future, or will he be doing vitamin supplement commercials in five years? We have no idea. We'll have to stay tuned and find out. These animations are great. And the noises are good, too, except for the coughing noise. That one's gross. <laughs> I like how he's just up being at him now. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Nice little three-piece there. Oh, Sandstorm answering back. Might be too little too late. 54 damage on his final stock. And keep in mind, this will be our first seeded, our first bounty player to go down. That's true. It'll be 10 bucks in Little Cap's pocket. Which is nice. I mean, off of the winnings a, that he might get, or, a, or that he will get from Tekken, and the winnings that he'll get from Brawlhalla. This could be a very lucrative weekend. That's a brisket sandwich. For sure. He's going for the finisher here, too. Oh, no. Sandstorm gets two stocked by Lil Cap. <sighs> All right, so that is our first bounty player knocked into losers. Congrats to Lil Cap making it into winner semis, a.k.a. top eight. And that was the only set with a bounty player in it that wasn't 2-0. It's true. It's true. Everything else has been a 2-0 Yeah, so it's far. just coming kind of a roll at this point. Everything's really been a 2-0 except Costlix versus Wrench. That was a 